They collect these small video shows, capsulodexis and intumescent cataracts. In this case, the main incision and two side ports have been made. The capsule has been stained. Now, viscoelastic substance is injected into the anterior chamber. Now, see how the rexis is being done. A 26 case bent needle is introduced through the side port and the intercapsule is incised and a C flap is made. C turbid fluid comes out, indicating high intralenticular pressure. It is expressed out. Now again, viscoelastic substance is injected. Now a uterator forceps is taken, and this the C flap is held, and a small rexis is made at this time around the anterior pole of the anterior capsule and now to decrease the intralenticular pressure some lens matter is removed so this is how some cortical lens matter is being removed with the help of a synco cannula you can see the nucleus rotates freely and now viscoelastic substance is injected again this is HPMC, hydroxypropyl methyl cellulose. Now a venous scissor is taken and a small nick is made at the margin of this rexis at around 7 o'clock. And now the uterator forceps is taken again. This capsular tag is held and with anti-clockwise movement an adequate sized rexis is done. That's it. The case is done. Hope this video will help you in your rexis in intumescent cataracts.